So today we want to create some parcels. Uh, so there are these two pieces of land here and a road seems to be passing in between those pieces of land. So we want to automate this process that created these parcels. For now, these are just uh, AutoCAD objects. These are just line work. <coughs> these are lines, uh, segments that are representing those plots. So what I'll do is, first of all, I'll, I'll create a plot for the whole, a parcel for the whole uh, piece of land. And then we'll, we'll see how we can use the parcel tools to create or to subdivide the, the whole plot into these into these parts <clears throat> okay so let's go right at it to the home tab we go to the parcels and we click on parcel creation tools and here i'll use this uh, this tool to create the the first parcel so what i'll do is just click on this tool there so this this first parcel that we're creating will be placed on the site written here site one and then the parcel style we'll call it property let's just call it property and then um the parcel for the labels area label will be will this will be this style and the other segments will be this so i check the automatically add segments label and therefore activate these label styles so this will be the label styles for these parcels for these segments the segments are there the lines that form the, the parcel itself so I click OK, and here I'm prompted to specify the start point. So let's start from here and go clockwise. So I'm forming the, the overall parcel first, and then I close there. And automatically you see the parcel has been, has been created. You can see the name of the parcel. So let me just click Escape, and we'll see. As you can see here, we have the label, the area label. So here it's telling us this is this area is 104 and this is the this is the parcel name. This is the area which is 0 0.3281 hectares approximately. <clears throat> so right now uh, I want to divide this whole area into these individual plots. So we may not be precise to what is shown here, but will be a bit accurate. So we'll be a bit near. <clears throat> a bit similar to what we see here okay so i go back to home tab again let me escape i go back to the home tab and i go to parcel creation tools and now i want to use the a command called slide create to create those subdivisions so i'll go here click on slide create so before i do that let's just check the let's just check the settings so here i know the area i know the approximate area for each segment for each parcel so it is something about three or five square meters and then let's leave that to that to the default and here the man maximum depth i do not want any maximum depth the automatic mode leave it to off and then we place remainder in last parcel all right, so we are ready to start the the slide create. So I slide line create. Again, I'm okay with this with these labels. All right, now we can change this to single family really. So this will be a different um, label for each parcel, different from the property label style that we selected for the whole piece of land. So if we click okay here. And then I'm prompted to select the parcel to be subdivided. So we already created that one. And then I am prompted to select start point on frontage. So this is the frontage. So we start there. And we take it all the way to, to that place. And then we're prompted to specify an angle. So just type 90. It's 90 degrees perpendicular to the slide line. As you can see, our our parcel our first parcel has been created and if you're okay with that we can now change this to automatic but before we do that we can we can first 
edit this this front this uh, maximum depth this front fronted width so here we can put this to mild numbers then here we can put we can reduce this maybe to four okay no that one we do not need to reduce so let's leave it as it was minimum depth so this one also can reduce okay so now that, that we're okay with this we can we can change the formation of the rest of the pieces of land or the plots or the parcels to automatic mode so let's change this automatic layout from off to on and let's see what happens as you can see it becomes quite near to what we want so uh, the remainder distribution let's see so we can create a, a parcel from the remainder but better yet we can redistribute the the remaining land so as you can see it becomes a little bit similar to what we had been created before by line work so if you're satisfied with that you just click on yes and those pieces of land or plots are now created and that's how you automate the process of creating plots or parcels if you like this video please do not forget to like to share and to subscribe to the channel thank you